Are you in need of FIFA 22 coins to improve your squad? Look no further than u7buy.com, offering some of the cheapest coins on the market, whilst being one of the safest and the most reliable websites around in the market today. Make sure as well, if you do go to the website, you use code VIPER at checkout to get yourself a discount. Let's get into the video. What's going on lads, Viper here, and welcome to another player review on the channel. Today, EA released Winter Wildcard um, Sal, or So, Gibral Sal. So, whatever you want to call him, he's got 3-star skills, 4-star weak foot, medium high, 84 pace, 85 dribbling, 74 shooting, 84 defending, 88 passing, and 90 physical. Now, he's an 84 and an 85. The 84 is 75 chemistry with an inform, and the 85 is 65 chemistry. Um, no inform requirement there. This card looks to be good, man. Um, he's 6 foot. Medium high with the uh, the four star weak foot, which is quite nice to have. Kind of like a Fofana esque player, um, is the way I'd describe him straight off the bat. He's not the easiest to link, so I've put him in on eight chemistry. I mean, he is on eight, it's just because I've just changed the team around. Um, basically, the only way you're really going to be able to link this card is if you've got a full Bundesliga team or you're going to somehow link him to Mbabu. I don't know how you're really going to be able to do that. So I thought. It would be logical to play him on 8 chemistry because I'd imagine that's the way you guys are going to play with him as well. Um, as we actually look at his in-game, so he's got good pace split um, with 83 and 85. Um, his shooting stats are okay, but you're not going to play him as a shooting player. This card is a CDM, maybe a centre mid. I'm not going to play him as a centre mid. I'm going to play him as a CDM in a 4 one 2 one 2 narrow. He has got really, really good passing with 86 vision. 86 short pass with 90 long pass. Really good dribbling for a CDM. 86 agility, 84 balance. Good reactions, good ball control and okay dribbling with great composure. He's got really high interceptions, really good defensive awareness and stand tackle. We don't really care about side tackle on this channel. I think it's a very, very silly stat and it doesn't really um, impact anything too much. And then he's got good jumping, really, really good stamina, great strength and aggression combo. I personally think you should be playing this card as a CDM, not a centre mid. Um, in terms of his traits, he's got no traits. Don't really need traits on a CDM though, right? As I said, this card is like a, an upgrade of Fofana, player of the month. Um, in my opinion, anyway. Looks very, very similar, but with higher agility and balance. And just better dribbling generally. Um, better strength and aggression combo as well, I believe. Let's actually have a look at Fofana um, whilst we're here to compare the two. Um, where are we? Go and get Fofana. Bosch. So if we can compare them just on base stats. So Fofana has less pace, less shooting. What's the what's going on with the passing? He has less passing as well. Um, same dribbling. And Sal has um, better defending and physical, which is nice to see. Um, so this is a great card, guys. Um, has lots of opportunities to go into your team as a great CDM. Obviously, the way I play this game at the moment, I'm playing 4 one 2 2 very aggressive. I think a shadow is going to be the best chem style for him. Um, even on 8 chemistry, right, he's going up to 91 pace. He's getting a big boost on his defensive awareness and his interceptions. Great stand tackle. Um, and yeah, I think he's going to be a great CDM, guys. I really, really do. Um, that's the way we're going to play him. We're 14 and 3 in champs right now. Um, so we're playing at a very high elo, trying to get rank 1. Um, so we're going to go play one game with him in... Um, champs see how we get on with him guys um obviously probably coming in at about 120 150k which isn't bad there we go nice from sal good pass from him too mbappe into vj i've done too much with that oh no i haven't nice good goal um it's one all now and that was actually all started from sal weren't it he got the interception I and mean, then played a really good ball up Nice. Uh, let's go, Ronaldo. That all started from Sal again. Both the goals that came from Sal, to be fair. Um, winning the ball back. One in VJ. Oh, I can't play that. All right, boys. Because the first game was such a sweat fest, I only showed a few highlights. Um, yeah, we're, we're playing big sweat, sweats right now, obviously. we're. At, um, I lost that last game as well. Um, I should have won it. I bottled a lot of chances. Um... But yeah, I'm going to show you the first half here. 
I really, really did like him in the in the uh, the first game, though. He actually sorted out quite a lot of opportunities for us. Oh my god, I'm gonna go one 0 down straight away. I don't believe this game, man. Honestly, I, I honestly, I, I you should I, I should have shown you some of the things that are happening in the, in the last game. Whatever, man. I'm gonna keep you with me. I'm gonna keep you with me. Uh, but you would have seen a few of the highlights um, from the last game. And he's very, very, very good at cutting the lane and um, getting the chance, which is what he done a few times. Um, because this formation is so aggressive and counter-attacking that I'm playing, when he does win the ball back, straight away there's an opportunity to go forward. The other thing is that you'll, you'll notice is um, when he does win the ball back, his passing is so good. Um, and when it does stick with him, which isn't very often, I must admit, um, it, when it does stick with him, his passing is so good that he's able to drill it up the pitch, which is really, really nice. Um, yeah, that, that last game was just uh, very, very chalk. So um, I can't believe that guy scored and then left. That's just, just disgraceful behaviour. Um, but yeah, um, this is 14-4 uh, and four right now, so I need to win this game if I want to get rank one. Um, hopefully we do. And Sal is great, man. The hell? Oh my god. I'm bottling. I've been doing that so much, guys. I'm like trying to ball roll the keeper, but the, the guy doesn't bring the keeper out all the way. It's stressing me out big time. It's my own fault though. I'm playing poor. Um but yeah, we're just we're just gonna stick here. Um you're gonna get the rawest review on him if I just keep him in the Oh come on, Beckham man. I know I've read it, but um yeah. It's the best way for us to uh, kind of show him, you know, um, by staying with the game. He was really, really good in the in the last game too. But yeah, the one issue with him is the ball doesn't seem to stick with him when you tackle. Wow. As you can see here, he's very, very good at them passes. We can play it back into him there. Oh, it's unlucky. <clears throat> here he is here. He's jockeying field fast as well, which is nice. There we go. Nice from him. Back into him. Into Ronaldo. BJ's gone. And just like that, you're in. Oh, my days, man. That's what Sal was so good at, you know. How have I not scored there? Wow, what a finish. Um, yeah, he's really good, guys. Like, He's very, very good at like the, the, like, the counter press, which is nice. Um, his dribbling feels quite sticky as well. Which is strange for somebody that's kind of considered to be like a proper CDM. Um, yeah, he's enjoyable when he has a great ping on him. Look at that. One in VJ. Let's uh, recycle this. Get him into Sal if we can. Sal into Dino. 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 2-0. There we go. Very nice. That all came from Sal there. Um, and yeah, that's now... Two games done with him. I kind of feel like I have to play a third. Um, and I will. And if we get any highlights of him, I'll bring you back, all right? Um, but yeah. I need all right, guys. So I decided I'm just going to bring you back for this half. And then we're going to review him. I'm going to the final part of the review. But let me tell you, just because you haven't seen a lot doesn't mean he's bad. I mean, it's just a bit harder to get get like clips and stuff with this card. Um, he's personally, what I would say, is probably the best CDM on the game right now. Like with like Vieira and stuff, like the best non icon CDM. He plays very, very, very well in game. Um It's just his ability to pass and dribble and be that good at CDM, you know, like actually have the CDM build and stuff. And which makes him so valuable in my opinion. We go with VJ, what's VJ got? This guy's got a sweaty team as well, so I, I do want to be careful. There is Sal there. Sorry if I do go a bit silent as well, guys. I just am sweating. What a ball, VJ. Yes, Ronaldo. What a goal, man. What a goal. Um, and this is a kind of like a, a, a double-edged sword, right? Because I'm having to sweat so hard, I'm not talking as much. But I, I am trying to give a raw review on him. Oh, that's got to go in. That's, that's a penalty. We've got to track back here with Sal. 
Keep going, keep going, keep going. He's offside, he's offside. So I won that anyway, wow. I've got to say, guys, I think this card's brilliant. Another upgrade to a lot of your guys' teams? For sure. Done one too many there. I thought he was going to read it. And we're in control of this game here, though. Oh, dear. That's poor from me. Be careful of EJ there. He's bottled that so hard. Into Sal. Good pass from him. We've got to wait for Beckham. Oh. Sal again. Into Dino. Dino fancies that. Dino fancies that. Oh. Oh, man. I apologise for not talking, but I really am trying to get rank one. Let's try a long shot with him. Oh. Unlucky. Long shot was decent there from uh, old Sal. He doesn't think I'm going to try that again. Into Mbappe. Oh, that's a beautiful goal. Oh. Just can't get a second goal, man, to get this guy to leave. VJ into the box. Oh, VJ. Oh, lucky for me there. Ronaldo. Oh, that's poor, that's poor, that's poor, that's poor. Mark, you've got him there. Well defended, well defended. There we go. I don't know where Sal is, though. I think Sal's covering at the back, isn't he? Dangerous. Good save, good save. Um, this is a very, very, very stressful... Like, game to be reviewing this card in, but I apologize for the, the lack of talking. But I'm hoping that you guys will be able to see via the gameplay how, how much I am trying to uh, review this card here. I'm not forcing the ball into him, just, just seeing. Man, his passing is sick. BJ, why did Mbappe not run there then? <laughs> Need to get onto Sal here. Nice. Back into him, back into him. Bang that up the pitch. Yeah, yeah. That's what he's great at, guys, is uh, like banging the ball up the pitch on the counter charge. When you get counter pressed as well, he's very, very good to pass the ball to. Look at this. Oh, what a ball. It's unlucky. There you go, he's pressing up here. Nice, Beckham. Sal, no, don't pass that straight away. No, I tried to cancel it. Oh my god, what the hell? That is what seems to happen, guys, a lot with Sal. Is like, they'll drill it into, into his path and then it will just like fall away from him. That's great from in there, though. Thought he was going to find that easy. Wow, good goal, man. I feel like I've absolutely dominated this game, guys. But you know, if you don't don't put the ball in the back of the net, then it's kind of on me, you know. Um, yeah, we're st we're still going in this game. Good defending. Man, I honestly don't even want to do this now. Like, I think I'm at too high an elo to really, like, give you guys a review. I, and I do apologise. This will still be going up. Um, not because, like, I, I'm not, you know, I'm not sane enough to review him right now. It's just because I feel like um, I'm just not talking enough. So it's not going to be that good to view. But hopefully you guys still do enjoy it. This is the, you know, ultimately this is going to be the best you're going to get at this high an elo. Um, in terms of... In terms of talking and stuff. Um, is he going to try and through ball that? He hasn't, to be fair to him. Oh, there it is. Nice Donnarumma. Right, let's go. Let's, let's, let's get a go on this attack. Into Sal. Nice weak foot on him. Oh, beautiful. Good stuff from Ronaldo. Man, I'm doing too much of it. I know I am. You don't need to tell me in the comments that I'm doing too much with the ball, right? 
So I can see that I am half time, guys. Um, seen a bit more Sal there. Uh, I'm going to bring you back now to the end of the review. All right, lads. So we played four games with him. We played um, one guy rage quit at the start, and then we played uh, three others. I guess I don't remember playing playing four. I thought I played three, um, but I really like this card. Okay. Um, in terms of who he's comparable to, um, I would say he's very close to Fo Fofana, but his passing is sensational. Um, a lot better than Fofana's, in my opinion. The four-star weak foot is really nice to have. The medium-high work rates are awesome as well. Um, dribbling felt relatively clean. Um, definitely a lot better than Fofana's. Um, I assume a lot of you do have Fofana's player of the month. Um, but the passing was the biggest thing with this card, okay? His passing, his driven passes, his through balls are nuts good. Um, his strength and aggression you can feel as well. Um, and his defending generally is quite good as well. He's very good at cutting the passing lanes with his good agility and balance. Um, just don't shoot with him is what I would say. If you don't shoot with him, which I'd imagine you wouldn't be anyway, he'll be good as a CDM in the 4 3 one if you want to play him as that proper CDM. And then you can also try him as the low CDM in the 4 one two, 2 narrow, which is what I like to do. Um, he was really good there as well. I think this is a great, great CDM. One of the best in the game that's not an icon. Or basically, which isn't Vieira, um, in my opinion. I prefer this card to Kante. As I said in the gameplay early on, I don't mind Kante. But then when it comes to his poor passing, it really does put me off the card. Um, and I do genuinely think this card is a lot better than Kante. So, um, you know, he, he can offer a lot more going forward as well with his great passing. And okay shooting, which Kante doesn't have. Um... And the agility and balance is nice. He jockeys really, really quickly, which is a great thing to have. And, you know, the price is relatively cheap for this card. Um, I think he's a must-do card, genuinely. Um, I, I think he's going to be in my team as my main CDM until team of the year now. Because um, I'm not going to do Vieira, even though I do love him. I just don't have the fodder to really put into that. Um, but, yeah, this is this is a great card. And I'm going to try and keep him in my team until team of the year. I really do, do enjoy him that much. He kind of helped me and carried me in the games that we played. Um... You know, it's very important in the 4 one 2 one 2 one narrow specifically to have a seriously powerful, fast CDM and one that can play out um, when you're in trouble as well. And that's what he offers. He's hard to link. Um, that is the only downside really to this card. Um, other than that, I really do enjoy him. I'm going to give him a 10 out of 10. Or may maybe not a 10 out of 10. Let, let me give him a 9.5 because no player is 10 out of 10, okay? Um, he is that good, guys. Go and complete this card. Go and get him in your team. Even if you only have to play him on 8 chemistry like I have in this video, he will still be an asset to you, okay? Um, but guys, if you did enjoy today's video, make sure you leave a like on it um, and you subscribe to the channel if you're not already. Sorry that the gameplay was a bit different today and a bit quieter. Um, they were very, very sweaty games. But guys, that's going to be it from me for now, so take care.